$150,000 scholarship. Well, if you're craving corn dogs, live entertainment, and carnival rides, you can find all that and more at the DeCoin State Fair. News 3's Maya Skinner joins us now to tell us about the fair's kickoff. Maya? Julie and Mark, there were hundreds of people out at the fairgrounds today. Although it was a little hot, some families told me they were happy to be back at the fair after it was canceled last year because of the pandemic. If you haven't visited the fair yet, the Illinois Department of Labor told me inspectors have been inspecting the rides all week and their workers will be at the fair in case anything goes wrong. They say attendees can also stay safe by paying attention to guidelines for those rides, staying hydrated and keeping your phone in a safe place. Several officials, including Governor J.B. Pritzker and Illinois First Lady, attended the ribbon cutting and then there was the Twilight Parade. Here's what some families had to say about that fair. COVID and stuff. So as soon as they were talking about lineups and within the dates that they were going to start, we were, we were jumping on that. It was exciting. Of course, it's good, especially for the kids. Our son is here and he's just old enough to kind of like collect the candy. And uh, we're here with some friends, so he's getting to hang out with his buddies too. And if you have concerns about COVID-19 precautions, there are sanitation stations and six feet markers for attendees. And we have a complete list of all the events for the fair on our website, WSILTV.com. Live in the studio, Maya Skinner, News 3. Coming up.